This video will focus on how to create a new project in HTH Golden Ear. On the toolbar, we have an icon that allows us to create a new project. So we will click this icon, and up will come the, a Name Project dialog box. It's important to understand here that what you were setting is the location of a directory which will hold all the essential documents for your project. So when you place a file name in here, which I'm going to call test3, what is going to happen behind the scenes is that a new directory will be created with your path, in my case C golden ear2, and then test 3. So you click on open and the new project is created and you are now ready to record when you when the court session begins. So another demonstration here is that we have the currently the word menu and the uh, word toolbar visible we decide we don't want these visible so that we can have more room for our text, we can hide those. So at this point, you are now ready to record. So what I'm going to do here is I've got my Dragon support enabled, which is done by hitting the Alt D. Now I've disabled Dragon support, and now I've enabled Dragon support. What, what this does is it allows us to, when we hit record all, the Dragon microphone will automatically turn on and be ready to um, turn our voice into text. And when we hit stop at the end of our session, the microphone will also turn off so that we do not get any extraneous words in our document. Now it's, in, it's important to know that if we want to use Dragon support, we must not be typing in the text area. So let's, let me start here with a couple of, a couple of lines of text to go here. Question. Colon. Where were you on the evening of September 20th, 1999? Question mark. New line. Answer. Colon. Colon. I was on vacation with my family in Maine. Period. Now, as you could see, I would speak, and Dragon would, would turn my text, my speech, into text. And I can continue in this way throughout my entire session. Now, if I want to then, somebody wants me to read back this question, I can then highlight anywhere in this question. And then if I want to hear it on my own speakers before I... Um, play it to the courtroom, I can press the preview playback. And when I do this, I hear the courtroom audio in my headset. And then when I am confident that I have the right uh, audio to play, I can then hit court playback. And now the courtroom will be able to hear if you have speakers set up for the courtroom to hear. Now, that will end this audio and video message.